little things you do in day to day life actually help in self development your conduct tells you who you are let me give you some advice which i received in my growing up professionally as well as personally don't call anyone more than twice continuously if they don't pick up your call presume they have something important to attend to return money or anything for that matter you borrowed even before the person you borrowed from remembers or asks for it 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 shows your integrity and character never order the most expensive dish on the menu when someone is giving you lunch or dinner or any meal don't ask awkward questions like oh so you aren't married yet or don't you have kids or why didn't you buy a house till now or why don't you buy a car for god's sake it's it, it that this is not your problem always open the door for the person coming behind you it doesn't matter if it is a guy or or a girl senior or, or a junior you have to treat everybody alike if you take a taxi or any service for that matter along with a friend and he or she pays now or at that time try paying it next time respect different shades of opinions remember what is 6 to you will appear 9 to someone who's facing you besides second opinion is 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 actually good for an alternative never interrupt people when they're talking allow them to pour their expressions out as as they say hear them all and filter them all if you tease someone and they don't seem to enjoy it stop it there and then and never do it again it encourages one to do more and it shows how appreciative you are say thank you say thank you when someone is uh, helping you say it liberally praise publicly criticize privately then there is almost never a reason to comment on someone's weight just just say you look fantastic compliment if they want to talk about losing weight they will talk themselves you know that to point it out don't do body shaming when someone shows you a photo on their phone don't swipe left or right no you, you never know what's next or before it's a matter of privacy if a colleague tells you they have a doctor's appointment don't ask you know what it's for just say i hope you're okay i, I hope you're fine don't put them in a in an un- uncomfortable position of having to tell their personal illness to you if they want you to know they will do so without your inquisit inquisitiveness beg your pardon if a person is speaking directly to you staring at your phone at that time or elsewhere is is impolite if not rude always remember that eye contact is part of conversation and speech eye contact is part of conversation and speech thank you